do, 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 do. last bit of the day. So we're on the Polish. Oh, I forgot to do the entrance on the last video. Okay, so we are on a Poland section of this book here, and I left you in the last video with the words "one who is was colon." Colon the Barbarian. <laughs> no, Nicholas Copernicus. Copernicus was a Polish astronomer, best known for his theory that the Sun, and not the Earth, is at the centre of the universe. Less well known for his theory that cream cakes have a higher gravitational pull than jam donuts and should therefore be eaten first. Copernicus's minor work, oh my god, I'm not going to read this, De Revolutionibus Orbitum Celestium which translates as On the Revolutions of the Celestial Spheres, although probably not the way I just pronounced it, was finished by 1530. His minor work, De Donuts Pack and Wait On, Donuts Are Yummy, <laughs> was finished by tea time, and no one else got a bloody look in. <laughs> he also, in 1517, set down a quantity theory of money, a principal concept in the economics to the present day. This posits that the less money you have, the less chocolate eclairs you can buy. <laughs> this theory was widely adopted widely by the UK Conservative government in the 2010s, when they cut disability benefit on the grounds that if people had no money for food, they would not get obese. The Revolution of Bus Orbitum Celestium was published in early 1543, and so as not to pay any tax on it, Copernicus died on 24th of May the same year. His last words were, Bet Swain Galileo took my lad Cherry Bakewell. Make sure he gets a copy of my book and gives it to the Pope as a Christmas present. Then there's some brackets. It says, See Italy, it's in book one, I'll take cash. Book one, I might do that later on. The central theory of, oh, why do I keep writing this? The central theory of Derevolutionibus Orbitum Colestium was that the Earth rotates daily on its axis and revolves yearly around the Sun. He also argued that the planets circled the Sun. This challenged the long-held view that the Earth was stationary at the centre of the universe, with all the planets, the Moon and the Sun rotating around it. As a result of his work, everybody in Poland started closing their curtains during the day, which led to a population boom nine months later. Copernicus has been celebrated in many notable works of art, such as Astronomer Copernicus or Conversations with God, 1871-73, the acclaimed painting by the Polish artist Jan Majewko, and the Copernicus Monument outside Greg's in Cleethorpes, a 38-foot-high bronze and papier-mâché statue which shows him in deep thought whilst eating a strawberry turnover. Fun fact, Poland is the world's biggest amber exporter, and amber isn't pleased about it. <laughs> OK, that's it for this one. So Paul Murphy is Extremely Unlikely History of the World, Book two, uh, da 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 da. Hope you enjoy buying it. <laughs> it's only money, you don't need it.